All right, here we go. All right, so here's the newest software update. This is 2022.36.20, and that is the FSD beta 10.69.3.1. So full self-driving beta suspension. So improper use can get you suspended. This is nothing new here. Um, so let's see if we can go to the next one. Here's the 10.69 release notes. I'm gonna turn off that air so it doesn't um, come through the audio. So a lot of stuff, new stuff here with the 10.69.3.1, which I will be testing. So I'm gonna go ahead, you can pause that there. I'll scroll down and you can pause that if you want to read everything through here. A lot of bullet points here, a lot of into the weeds. Now it does say here, press the video record button on the top of the UI screen. When pressed, the vehicle's external cameras will share a short VIN associated autopilot snapshot with the Tesla engineering team. So I did see on Twitter the other day that that is gone and I don't see it up here. So typically it is up there. So. Apparently only the super beta testers get that now. So full self-driving beta, this is uh, limited access. Driving only on Tesla Vision, that is nothing new either. Visualization improvements as well. Cabin camera. So that's detecting hands on the wheel. I hope they get rid of the need to uh, show that your hands are in the wheel the energy app. So learn more for, about your energy consumption. So it looks like there's a couple updates here with the energy app as well. So that's nice to see. Cabin overheat protection. Pretty self-explanatory. The Tesla app, a few additional media player details and ETA to a destination when en route is, act, is active from the Tesla app. Oh, okay. So I guess you can see, you know, if you have a GPS location set in your, um, uh, on the screen here, then it should show up through the Tesla app. That's something we can test later. Supercharger additional details. So now it'll s display historical site occupancy. What else we got? Car left open notification. This is not new. So I've gotten this before. In an additional language here. It looks like that is it. So some of these things are repeats, like the notification to your phone when a car is left open, that's already been here. Um, some of these Tesla app improvements I'll test and do a subsequent video uh, follow-up. But now I wanna test the full self-driving beta. Let's hit the road. Okay, so as you can see here, look, the turn signal actually turns on and that's gonna happen out of a lot of these switchbacks. So keep your eye out for that. I kind of think it's turning on the turn signal every time it has to turn the wheel, um, you know, a certain degree.
overall really impressed with this fsd beta going to do a lot more testing with it so definitely if you haven't done so yet make sure you subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications so you're updated every time i upload a video i hope you guys liked this video if you did please give it a thumbs up thanks so much for watching share this video with a friend and don't forget to hit that subscribe button as always see you in the next one